So here we are at the end of the season, and this is the first season of this sim where we have missed the playoffs with only 87 points. We were very mediocre. Even the trade with the trade deadline acquisitions, we stayed mediocre. <laughs> McKinnon and Larkin both went off 77 points. David Krejci put up 19 points in 19 games, so he was great for us, but it just wasn't quite enough. March or so had 18 points in 19 games, so the trades definitely helped the team out. Raymond, 59. Kopp, 51. Zadina, 50. Perron, 43. Soderblom, 39. Marco Casper was only 17 in his rookie year. Went up from an 81 to 82, though, so that's not bad. Edvinson is up to an 84. Roberg stayed at an 81, so it was a very mediocre season. I'm really surprised to see how few games were actually lost to injury, because after every other game, there was an injury. But we didn't actually lose that many man games to injury, so that's very bizarre. Billy Huso played in 71 games. The assistant coach did not like putting Justice Anunin in, even though he had a 9-10 save percentage. Huso was solid with that 905. Kucherov with 115 points, Point with 104, those guys went off, Matthews with 99 right there, Eichel and Stamkos at the bottom of the page there, had great years. Kucherov wins the racket with a whopping 61 goals, definitely did not expect that out of him. I see Rensfeld down there, the medium franchise guy on the Chicago Blackhawks. Assists, the leader with Braden Point by quite a bit with 79. Quinn Hughes makes the list with 60 at the bottom there. Dowdy is really good in the sim for some reason. Quinn Hughes with 74 points, so maybe he'll be taking home the Norris. There's no Makar on this first page at all. Boatfist with 65. Where is Kale Makar? 59 points for him. Pretty terrible for a 95 overall defenseman. He doesn't sim too well for whatever reason. It looks like Spencer Knight is going to be taking home the Vesna. 34 wins and a 916 save percentage. And then Markstrom was. Solid down there with the 9-10 save percentage, playing in a whopping 72 games! It is likely that Matvey Michkov is going to be taking home the Calder with 54 points in 73 games. He's an 83 high elite. Fantilli is an 82 high elite. Also had 54 points though. He played more games, so I'm assuming that means Michkov wins it, but who knows for sure. Omara, franchise player, 87 overall, 49 points. Probably doesn't quite win it there. The Seattle Kraken are Stanley Cup champions! Here's what the playoff tree ended up looking like. Columbus and Johnny Goodrow against Seattle. Winnipeg is another good team. Philadelphia is really good in this. Like, look at these bottom four. In my real life predictions, I don't have any of those four even making the playoffs this year. And it's only 2025, so a lot has changed. Johnny Goodrow went off in the playoffs, 29 points in 24 games. Wenberg, likely the con, Smythe went in there with 25 points in 25 games. He only scored two goals. The Kraken went big and got Debrink at 24 points, 25 games. It might also be him. Shane Wright, let's see his overall now. 88 overall. He is a beast. Matty Beniers, also an 88 overall. That Seattle team is looking dangerous. And there we see it again. Kraken Cup champs. Rangers won the President's Trophy. Clarence is Campbell to the Kraken. Prince of Wales to Columbus. Kucherov, Art Ross. Kucherov, Hart. Norris to Maureen Riley, Lady Bing to Kucherov. Adam Fantilli won the Calder, even though Michkov had the same amount of points in less games. But I used to work for the Chicago Steel. Fantilli was playing there. Super good dude. I'm glad he's winning it in the sim. Winberg, Conn Smythe, Knight to Vesna and the Jennings. Masterton to Kale McCarr, that's interesting. Jack Adams. Back to back to back for the San Jose Sharks coach, that's insane. Selkie to Crosby, that's surprising. Kucherov, Ted Lindsay, and Maurice Richard. Kucherov just swept. I did forget to show the regular season standings in the last one, so here we have a quick look at them. I'm just gonna scroll through it really fast. Kraken were the second best team in the league, so I guess it makes sense that they were cup champs. Ottawa missed at 15. It was mostly just the best teams got in. There we were in 21 right there. So we're in a weird spot to pick. And Buffalo Sabres are hoping for that first overall pick. St. Louis and Minnesota, both awful teams now. Pittsburgh finally rebuilding after years of success. And Colorado wins the draft lottery going up from six to one. We stole McKinnon from them and their team just collapsed apparently. Islanders picking two. We are picking 12. 
Eric Stahl finally calls it quit. Brent Burns is done at the age of 40. Still 82 overall, solid player, but he calls it Zidane Chara at 48 years old. Finally done. Wayne Simmons there. Eric Stepan. Let's see the goalies. Pat Maroon too. Greg Anderson at the age of 44. Anton Kujo and Alex Stalag, so nothing too crazy. Brent Burns is now a coach, so Pavelski and Burns are both coached. That's really cool. Brian Boyle is now a scout. 